Um, primarily the image quality and the size of the cameras are what makes me use the DX series most of the time these days. I, um, it's really important for me to be able to deliver very good image quality to my clients. Um, but my style of photography means that I have to be as discreet as absolute possible. Um, I'm a wedding photographer, so I try not to be seen at the weddings. So the little cameras, perfect for that. Um, but the image quality has to be there also. And the image quality matches the DSLRs, so uh, it's, it's a perfect match. Yeah, absolutely. To me, eye contact and the emotion of the wedding is the most important part of it. Um, it's really important for me, my clients to be able to look at their wedding pictures and feel emotionally attached to those pictures. Uh, if I can see eye contact or touch or feel between the subjects of the picture, then I want to capture that. I can capture it really quickly uh, and really, really discreetly using these cameras. Uh, where I come from in the UK, often we're not allowed to take photos of certain ceremonies, etc. So being able to have a silent shutter speed, a sort of silent shutter I should say, and be able to just work completely discreetly, I can get those moments that, that perhaps I would never have been able to get in the past. Absolutely, yeah, the size is the most important thing. Um, these little cameras, not only does it help physically with the body, um, because you're not lugging around all of the big equipment, but it just helps you blend into the background and blend into the wedding. Um, and for all intents and purposes, I've become just a guest at the mm -hmm. wedding, so it's great. Um, I've only, I'm only here for, another, for one day of free time, effectively. So, um, Yuto kindly said he was going to take me to the fish market, um, which I really want to do. Uh, but then he told me we need to go at three o'clock in the morning, so uh, might be a bit too early, but we'll see. I'd love to go and see that and photograph that. And uh, I love shooting street photography and candid photography on the street also, so it'd be very exciting to do something like that. I love it. I love the wide conversion lens. Um, it's, it's on my camera 95% of the time now. Um, although it's, it's widening the image, the sharpness is still the same. Um, it just gives me that little bit extra. My style of photography is about storytelling, so getting that little bit more in the frame is perfect. Um, and the ability to just take it off really quickly also is great. I think with the X100S, I use that more now, um, but the X-Pro1, probably about 50-50. Yeah, yeah, because the, the, obviously the ability to change the lenses on the X-Pro1. The X100 is more for when I'm walking around and I'm just at or in the, the dark churches and I need to be absolutely quiet and I just go for a wander around the wedding. Uh, the X-Pro1 is generally used more for things like bridal prep and speeches, etc., where I can plan the scene and, plan, and I know what's going to be happening so I can predict which lens to use, etc. Yeah, absolutely. Um, the X-Series cameras are just perfect for pretty much every type of photography that I can think of. Um, certainly the stuff that I specialize in, wedding photography, it's going to allow you to get into positions that you didn't think you could get into with the big DSLRs. You're going to be discreet. Um, but the most important thing is you still get the image quality, the low light performance, um, and your clients are still going to be absolutely very happy. So. Something funny. Wow. <laughs> no, not funny. Okay. Something relaxed. Um, <laughs> the the X series are you know they're just great for posture and you know bad backs go away and you you don't get pointy eyebrows like mine without having nice cameras around your shoulders. <laughs>